all right guys welcome to our brand new series on the channel and that is pokemon sword randomizer now this is going to have a few rules added to it we're going to go over them today and also pick our starter pokemon and um, so our sword randomizer nuzlocke is just like any other and uh, normal nuzlocke rules apply so one uh, pokemon per root or slash wild area um we're gonna have if a Pokemon dies, it dies, things like that. So that is all here. We are gonna add a Soul Link aspect to this uh, randomized Nuzlocke as well. So if a Pokemon's prime, we can only have one primary typing in the team at a time. So if we have two Water Pokemon, we have to choose between them. Um, we're also gonna have a thing that if we fully wipe as a party, that is the run done and we'll restart. So it is, a, I think, a hardcore Nuzlocke is how we're gonna work it. Um, for the primary typings, we are not going to go off what the Pokemon is right now, if it's a pre-evo. We're going to go off its fully evo form. So if you were to get Charmander, it would be fire. If you were to get um, Eevee, it would be, you have to choose what evolution you're going to put it to beforehand. So you can kind of gauge the typing on that. Um, we might make a special thing for Eevee because you can evolve it to whatever you want. I guess. Um, but for any of Pokemon, we're going to go off the primary typing. Um, so yeah, that's the way this is going to work. There's going to be a brand new overlay, brand new picture for the back. These are going to go in tomorrow's episode. The reason I'm not in this one, I wanted to do the starter choice as a full screen. Um, and the overlay isn't, it's a bit smaller, and I wanted to do it properly as a full screen. Uh, so yeah, let's see what Pokemon we've got. I am very really hopeful about what we can get as a starter because it could be anything. So yeah, let's see if we can get a legendary or something like that. Not legendary, all horrendous. Cloyster, not a bad Pokemon. Marowak, not a bad Pokemon. Sloping, slow bro, not a bad Pokemon. The three together, all really low stats, all really bad. Um, but yes, I, I'm going more towards the Alolan uh, Slowpoke because it does evolve into two different Pokemon. is a really good one, bulky, ice type, really good. Won't have its skill link ability because they are random. We kind of have to, right? Yeah, we kind of have to. Um, right, let's, so let's take Slowpoke. And we are going to try and do nicknames during this series as well. This one is going to be called RD9 Games, as he comes to every single stream. So, it would be nice to honor that. Then, we do have, obviously, the other people that come to the streams as well. And comment on videos down below, so I will be nicknaming every single Pokemon that we get. Um, let's hope that I did the randomizer correctly. So, I'm still new to PKNX, so I don't know if it's done any of its move sets, if its typings are okay. If the typings aren't normal, um, we will reset all that to default and then re randomize. So the abilities might change for the first two Pokemon. Obviously, starter, that kind of thing. Um, but we will get it sorted by the next one. Um, so, yeah, we're kind of seeing if this happens in the fight, I guess. I hate the amount of talking in this game. You should be able to skip this, but you can't. I will be adding them settings on, by the way, to skip movies. I'll be adding um, fast text, things like that. Uh, we do have our rival battle to do here. However, I'm not in a very uh, optimistic one with just slow poke. Obviously, it depends on what Pokemon it's randomized hops to. So, because we've randomized every trainer, this will not be that start Pokemon of Shelder. Meaning, this could be a legendary, it could be anything. So, I feel like we might lose this. Okay. Ooh, a Nido then. Yeah, that's not too bad. Nidoran's not too bad. 
pressure. Okay, so the abilities are done. Um, so let's have a look at our slow poke. Has unburned and boosted speed stats depending on how long is used or lost. Um, it's also holding an iron. Looks like. So that is a Pokeball. I'm not going to count that as getting it off all. We'll get that off. Doom Desire. Right, okay. Um, I'm going to say that the movesets are not correct. Because their moves are definitely not moves you need around learn, which is really bad on my part. I do apologise. So we are going to have to re-randomise the stuff. So the ability unburden will not be there in the next one. Um, unless I can randomise... No, because I have to set the control. Um, Spinal Call. Body Press. Oh. Okay. Spinal Call is just ice, right? Ice and rock. So that should appear. So yeah, I think Titans are wrong, which sucks. So yeah, so our, our, our typings are wrong and things like that. But we shall get all this sorted by the next episode. This is only going to be a short one of doing this bit here. Um, we'll probably do the legendary bit as well, going through the woods. And then we can start our next video with some encounters, which I'm really happy with. Um, I did put a community post up today about um, next week so as of Sunday I'm actually going away for work so I will not be able to do any streams until I get back on the 6th of August I think the 7th will be the day that I do my first stream so yeah sorry about that we will be doing videos still while we're there and there's a few things that I will be trying out on MFX Plus as well while we're over um, where we're going to work so I want to start recording things like Final Fantasy Rebirth I haven't played it yet so it would be very interesting to do a full playthrough on stream and um, slash video so that's what we're gonna do not only that okay so the wild Pokemon are oh, right, no, that's good um, one of the good things about doing that is we can also bring new games to the channel as well. So obviously, we love a bit of Rocket League, and we love a bit of COD. Um, I have been playing Mobile COD quite a lot. So that'll be really good. Um, we might be able to play a bit more of that, stream that on the channel. I am going to be taking my Algato with me. Because it is a portable one, it's the 4K 60S Plus. So it is very portable, very Zylu. Ooh, that was a really good one to get. And that means we can get a Lucario from the get go. That's really cool. Now, it does look like the movesets of these Pokemon haven't changed. I mean, we haven't had an attack yet other than Quick Attack. But they haven't had anything like Boom Desire, so I think it might only be the trainers that have weird moves. Which I'm happy with. If it's going to make it harder like that, I'll take it. I'm not too happy with the typing though. I'm sure Binacle is going to go to type. So let's go to our Pro Decks and we can have a look. By the way, Pro Decks does not sponsor the video or channel or anything. It's just a really good app for the price it is really good for any po people doing Pokemon, if you want to look at movesets of a certain game, things like that, they are all on here. <coughs> right, so, Binacle. It's a rock water type, so it should have been hit by a normal type. It's half, but yeah, so I think we might have to change that and default the trainer Pokemon back to normal and then sort the typings out and things like that so that isn't the case because I do not want it to be random movesets and random um, typings. We might keep the movesets, I think that's pretty cool to have on the uh, series. Um, we might even start a Scarlet and Violet one after this if we find a randomizer for it. To be honest I'm just really happy that we've got this one working because it took us a long time. Yeah, so the normal wild Pokemon do not have random movesets. 
So I'll take that as a plus. <coughs> so we can go and get our first encounter, things like that. So it's just going to be the trainer Pokemon and abilities, things like that. We have to change that. But we can do that by the next video anyway. Now let's see what this Pokemon is because random Pokemon are here. So this could be anything. Alright. It could be a case of... We still won't be able to hit it. Because I feel like that would crash the game, right? So let's see. Well, there's a Zashian, so that's cool. Zashian is so broken in this game. If you ever played VGC during this era of Sword and Shield, he was so broken. <coughs> so it is still Zashian. Okay, so you can't change this Pokemon. Which is fine. I hate this battle, it's just pointless. Like, so pointless. By the way, the temperature in the UK is so hot right now. Look at this you don't have AC in every house in the UK, and it's, I really want to get it. It just costs too much money to add to the house. <coughs> You know what, we will take our first encounters, we will go and get the Pokeballs and see what our first encounter is. If I'm right, it's a guaranteed um, capture, so it could be anything there as well, which I, if it's a legendary, I'll take it. So we have a few choices, right? We have, when we go to an area, we can pick the first Pokemon we pop, that pops up. Um, or we can do exclamation marks only. I think exclamation marks only is better because it is completely random. However, in the wild area, that might not be able to be done. So we might have to flip a coin or do a random number generator and pick, the, say, the third Pokemon on screen or whatever it comes up out as. Right. Let's go. Yep, she is. Oh wow, it's still groupy there, that's weird. Okay. Let's go, let's run get our first encounter. It's a nice way to end the video. Like I said, I think it is guaranteed. So, I'll take it. <coughs> I don't know if we've got balls yet though. Uh, we want to go to options, we want to set fast, off, set automatic, skip movies on. Okay, so we do all, already have that on, so. Okay. Now this technically, if we have balls, that's great, because we can just catch our straight away. We have five. So let's see what we could have got. Oh, Persian. Is that a Gibble? No, a Mud Kit. <coughs> okay. Okay, or we can do it this way and our first Pokemon is whatever runs into us. I think we'll do the rule of exclamation mark or whatever runs into us first because it's random then. I feel like this is a guaranteed catch. If it is Persian, it's a really good one to have anyway. It is a guaranteed catch. Okay. So, we do have a Persian on the team. That's really cool. Really good problem to have. Fake out, things like that. So, for gyms, it'll be very good to have. Um, but, yeah. I wonder if we could go back to the woods beforehand. I would have preferred the mud kit, I'm not going to lie. But... Persian's also not a bad Pokemon. So let's go and have a look at <coughs> the woods and see if we can get a Rylan. 
because Ryalu would be sick. If we don't get Ryalu, we can get something else. No, we can't. It's locked. Okay, well, that's where we're going to end this video. Thank you all for watching. Um, please leave a comment down below on what you think some of the rules should be or some of the challenges we should have in the future because we are going to bring things like a wheel. Um, but yeah, so subscribe to the channel, comment down below, like the video, and I'll speak to you all in the next one.